For centuries, farmers in Sri Lanka have relied on their traditional knowledge passed down through generations to make agricultural decisions. But variations in usual weather patterns in Sri Lanka have made this method less reliable. As of late, farmers find that natural indicators of weather, such as cloud formations and behavior of certain birds and insects, are no longer sending out the right signals. Therefore, a more scientific approach should be adopted to provide farmers with accurate and timely weather and climate information. This is where the Institute of Policy Studies stepped in. We undertook a three-year action research study which proposed an integrated climate information management system to bridge the climate information and communication gaps. The intention was to generate more effective adaptation decisions. Uh, one issue we observed from the beginning is that uh, information is most important when it comes to the farmers uh, because uh, we found that uh, farmers are maybe becoming uh, helpless because of this uh, lack of uh, climate information on time. Uh, farmers were using their knowledge but uh, it is not actually uh, working for them uh, uh, for various reasons. Uh, then uh, they are not actually using the uh, existing uh, weather forecast also because uh, they found uh, this uh, existing weather forecast information are not uh, catering their requirements. So uh, that's that that see, uh, the gap uh, provided uh, the real uh, motivation for this uh, research study. Uh, then uh, we thought of. Uh, Coming up, a, coming up with a novel approach, so where yeah, that not to replace the uh, entire uh, existing uh, thing with the scientific forecast, or that uh, uh, either to go with the traditional system alone. So then uh, our approach is to integrate in both of them. So that's how we uh, planned that uh, we can bring farmers knowledge as well as uh, scientific knowledge and make, make something much more useful for farmers. With funding from the Opportunity Fund of the Think Tank Initiative of the International Development Research Centre, Canada, IPS partnered with the Department of Meteorology and Janathakshan to establish an effective research consortium. The Department of Meteorology, by its mandate, served as the climate information provider, while Janathakshan took the lead in field mobilization. The project began in 2016, bringing together a host of foreign and local experts to decide the crucial areas that needed to be covered. This was followed up with a comprehensive baseline survey which studied 900 farmers in six districts, namely Anuradhapura, Kurunagala, Badulla, Batikalo, Ratnapura, and Hambantota. These districts were chosen based on their distinct features to represent the varied agroecological zones of Sri Lanka. We then identified suitable farmer organizations in each district to implement the interventions. To measure the real impact of the project on farmers in a scientific way, we selected appropriate control sites as well. Apart from the survey, a round of participatory rural assessments was carried out to collect additional information. 
The responses helped to gain a deeper understanding of issues related to agricultural practices, the need for information products, and the existing gaps in the sector. The project aimed to upgrade the technical capacity of the Department of Meteorology, thereby improving the accuracy of the weather forecasts. As such, IPS provided necessary equipment to the Department of Meteorology and trained its officers as part of the project. Biaprote pada hari Rabu nak pernah, desa guna turut turun. Kenne Govind tu koi akarin laba dina dikela. Kenne laba di mata mai ikar Rabu nak pernah. Dan ati mana desa guna vipara sama ke? Apa jangan no? Adik awal sya apa tenang ikat ikat lebi nawa. Ewa game ma itu sahabek cewa. Besi nomedi tap tiak kapita ati ni kerana tulai kenne besi nomedi tu diri kala ti no. Di mana guna pelajar mereka desa pun ini pada hari ini dah mereka kini api direction yang kerap itu tak terjadi. Di mana tak terjadi ke arah ego lori sah perdaya ke krama bahagian kiri mereka yang yang mawas tahu ini apa sahaja yang kita ego lori pada hari ini guna pelajar ini tiada. Maka dah ini tak terjadi ini akar ini novena mawas tahu tiada. Namun mami teri kian dah ek berdi kela ek mereka nak bidan no pariseri mina swimas mina swim. Kalau guna yang tekan, lokus sambang dia tiada kira. Apa yang kita balap untuk tuh nanti, ini, ini kalau kita ni sah perdaya kan, dalam bayi, eva game, dalam tuh kita takshen. Karena kalau guna anak yang kita perkasa kerana tiap hari takshen itu tiada. Ini takshen kita kerana kita nama yang tiap hari kalau guna anak yang kita kapi, bidyaat mako laba deh. Terus ini bidyaat mako kerana bawa kita kerana ini laba deh. Kalau guna anak yang kita, ini kalau kita ni sah perdaya kan. तोरतोरी देखा बाई ताक करना कोई आकारे इधर ये टा में तब तो नरायनों के लिए कतार में आप ही बलापुर एक ने बेके बलापुर तो ने दिन अत्ते में एक ए ए साधा आप ही ए विशेष इन आप ही दिए ना बीएड कलापे तेत कलापे वाके मात्र में निकलापे स्थान की प्यार तोर आगे ने क्या ने गोविंदन काटो तो करने स्थान की प्यार � अभी लाभ दूँ ना कारों को ना आएगे कि दिन पता लाभ दे रहा लाभ दे ले बेर ना अभी कीना मेरे मेक का बावी ताकर आने ये गांव में उगल एगोल के साम पर दायक रबत बावी ताकर में किरकी हुआ इतना अमतर हुआ अभी एगोलों देनुवत करा कारों ने क्या ने मुकाबले कीने का तभी देनुवत करा इतना अमतर हुआ अभी कारो Kerbau kuno me warca apa dina data tekka, ekonomi kebetulan kantu itu kau mahu dengar ni kini ke? Selas selas sumber ni kini ke? Tama ikhui waiting ayam dua, ekor dengan waktu lalu tina dengan dengan kapi kalau guna naik ke angkut, mereka dah ini kuat lebah dulu, na ini bagaimana? Diri kalau dah lebah dulu, na ini orang masih koi bagi tak tak kui dia, orang masih tu ni koi tak bagi tak tak kui dia, tu ni ayam dua, ekor lomge kebetulan kantu itu, 
සිදු කර ගන්න ආකාරය තමයි අපි මේකෙන් කාලෝ විද්‍යා දෙපාර්තමේන්තුවේ පැත්තෙන් විශේෂිත සිදු කරන understanding the need for engaging and interacting with the farmers the officers of the department of meteorology conducted trainings for farmers at their regional offices they were taught how to interpret the forecasts issued by the department and how to use these forecasts when making agricultural decisions the department of meteorology also provided rain gauges to farmers and instructed them on how to measure rainfall accurately with technologically advanced equipment this cleared up the misunderstandings and the mistrust between the farmers and the met department and cemented a close link between the two parties karana karane sambandhava api api pustana me parichan tumage pahana api me wede ata patan ganena ada api pala hita wana eka sambandha wenne etukota goyam pala sambandha එතකොට මොනා හරි මේ බීජ වර්ගයක් වේලන්න අපි එළියට දාලකොට අපි පුස්ත පරීක්ෂණතුමාගේ කලින් අහනවා එතකොට එතුමා අපට මේ දවසේ මේ මේ වෙලාවට මේ දවස් ගණන ඇතුළත මෙහෙම වැස ලැබෙනවා හැම කියලා එතුමා අපි දැනුවත් කරනවා එතකොට මම ෆාම් මේ ගහිලියා පාන්ත සංවිධානයේ මේ භාණ්ඩාගාරික විදියට වැඩ කරන්නේ ඒ කියන්නේ හැම දිනටම මේ සංවිධේන සපුර සපයන්නේ මම එතකොට මම ඒ අය මගෙන් ඇහුවම මම ඒ අපේ කණ්ඩායමේ හැම දිනටම එහෙම දැනුවත් කරනවා Farmer representatives and grassroots level officers were invited for an awareness program at the Department of Meteorology in January 2018 This was another key milestone in the project as the farmers got the opportunity to visit the Met department and witness firsthand the process of producing scientific forecasts. Here they witnessed the department's daily routine, how they use meteorological balloons to gauge wind direction and speed, how to read humidity levels, and how technical staff derives forecasts using complex computer models. The most important achievement of the project has been the bridging of the communication gap between the two parties. Throughout the project duration, the department has been providing localized short-term forecasts. The team from Janata Action undertook the coordinating role between the department and the farmers. Now, the farmers request seasonal forecasts, which are vital in planning the season well ahead of time. This obviously indicates the demand for improved climate information and more importantly thus justifies the importance of project intervention. It is interesting to learn how the farmers translate the scientific forecasts into their decision making process. As expected, we hear a lot of stories about how these have been useful to farmers. Karne විතමත්ම අඩු ජල ප්‍රමාණයක් තමයි මේ පදේ ජලාශයට ලැබුණේ. ඒකදී නමුත් වෙනදා මෙන්න මේ හොඳ අස්වන්නක් සියලුම ගෝ ජනතාව ලබා ගත්තා. ඉතාම සාර්ථක ක්‍රියාවලියක්. දැනට වසර දෙකකට ආසන්න කාලයක් ක්‍රියාත්මක වෙනවා. ඊයාස අපිට කාලගුණ කියන රාජ්‍ය ආයතන තුන කාශිල අපිට අපේ ගෝ සංවිධානය යම් ගෝ පිරිස් එකතු කරගෙන යම් යම් කාලගුණක තොරතුරු සපයා ගැනීම ආදී පිළිබඳ පොහොණීම් කටයුතු කළා. පදවීදී වාර කීපයක් ගෝ ජනතාව එක්රැස් කරලා කදාවස් කරා තොරතුරු එක්රැස් කරා ඒ වගේම ප්‍රදේශයේ වැඩි හිටියක් මෙන් තොරතුරු ගත්තා ඒ වගේම තවත් අපිට පොහොණේම් කටයුතු කරා බෞනියා ප්‍රදේශයේ කාලගුණ විද්‍යා දෙපාර්තමේන්තු මධ්‍යස්ථානයට රැගෙන ගොස් නැතුතු අපිට කොළඹදී කැඳවලා මේ වගේ යම් කිසි වැඩමුළුවක් කරා ඉතින් මේ වැඩමුළුවල සාර්ථක ප්‍රතිඵල අත්පත් වුණා ඒකෙන් මට කියන්න තියෙන්නේ ජනතාක්ෂණ ආයතනයට ඒ වගේම රාජ්‍ය ප්‍රතිපත්ති අධ්‍යයන ආයතනයට කාලගුණ විද්‍යා දෙපාර්තමේන්තුවට මේ සියලුම ඉහළ සිට පහළ දක්වා සියලුම ලිලේන්ට බෙහෙවින් අපි ගෝ ජනතාවගෙන් ස්තුතිවන්ත වුණා. අතර උන්ගේ ක්‍රියාදාමයන් නිසා ගෝ ජනතාවගේ ජන ජීවිතය යම්තාක් දුරට සාර්ථක වුණා කියන එක තමයි මගේ හැඟීම. By and large, the project has shed light on the importance of providing improved climate information to farmers. Though the project was implemented on pilot basis, it has provided important insights for replicating the interventions and the challenges that have come up. 
As intended, it proves that climate information can play a vital role in helping farmers to make better decisions amidst the increasing uncertainties in weather patterns. Thank you.